On November 7, 2024, the Slovak Ministry of Defense announced the acquisition of nine multipurpose VTV-4 by four tactical vehicles from three manufacturers, MSM Land Systems, Zeter Engineering, and DefTech. This acquisition will evaluate the capabilities of three different vehicles across a variety of operational roles. The goal is to meet the diverse needs of the Slovak Armed Forces and potentially lead to a larger purchase in the future. The vehicles chosen for this trial include the Patriot II from Excalibur Army, represented in Slovakia by MSM Land Systems, the Gerlach from Zeter Engineering, and the Wolf from DefTech. Each manufacturer will deliver three specific versions of their vehicles, an Armored Personnel Carrier, APC, a version equipped with a remote-controlled weapon station, RCWS, and a third variant with an Advanced Communication and Information System, KIS. The Ministry of Defense expects the initial vehicles to be delivered by December 20, 2024, with a fully equipped RCWS and KIS version scheduled for delivery by the end of 2025. The Patriot II, produced by Excalibur Army and offered by MSM Land Systems, is designed to provide modern, versatile capabilities for troop transport and tactical missions. It features advanced ballistic protection, capable of withstanding mine explosions and small arms fire. The vehicle's RCWS-equipped version enhances defense, allowing the crew to remain protected while operating the weapon systems. The KGS-equipped model integrates advanced command and coordination tools for real-time tactical management. Zeta Engineering's Gerlach offers a robust design optimized for challenging terrains while providing high-level protection for its crew. The APC version of the Gerlach is ideal for infantry missions, with strong armor and good cargo capacity. The RCWS version allows effective defense while minimizing crew exposure, and the KIS model ensures enhanced communication and coordination on the battlefield. The Wolf from DefTech is a lightweight, compact vehicle offering advanced mobility and protection. The APC version is designed for troop transport, providing protection against ballistic threats while maintaining agility. The RCWS version enables remote firepower capabilities, reducing crew risk, and the KGS-equipped version ensures superior communication for tactical operations. The total cost for the initial batch of nine vehicles is approximately 17 million euros, reflecting Slovakia's commitment to modernizing its defense capabilities. These vehicles will be tested by the newly established 11th Separate Regiment, formed in August 2024. This regiment will assess the performance, adaptability, and resilience of each vehicle in realistic operational conditions. Upon completion of these evaluations, the Ministry of Defense plans to select the most suitable vehicle for a larger purchase, potentially involving several hundred units. This larger acquisition is scheduled for 2026, with the possibility of including vehicles from multiple suppliers, depending on the results of the testing phase. Through this strategic approach, Slovakia aims to strengthen its defense by carefully selecting the best tactical vehicles for its forces, ensuring that its military is equipped with modern, reliable, and adaptable vehicles for various operational needs. Thank you.